Horses along the East Coast are now looking for a place to ride out this storm. Some are actually showing up in the Tampa Bay area. Eight on your side's Victoria Price has that story from the Florida State Fairgrounds in Tampa. Hey, good evening. This is one of the largest equestrian centers in the state. They can house up to nearly 500 horses. 35 horses are already here. We're here standing by ready to accept horses 24-7. Riding out the storm in Tampa Bay. As of Monday, the Bob Thomas Equestrian Center at the Florida State Fairgrounds is expecting at least 100 horses to evacuate here from Hurricane Dorian. Most of those coming are from Florida's east coast. They're not sure if their facility will withstand the storm that's coming as it, it is an unknown. The fairgrounds 471 stalls are all made of concrete blocks, providing a safe shelter even if strong winds blow through. The last big evacuation event was Hurricane Irma, where every single stall was full. But it is scary, and uh, we all just try to wait it out and be patient and and I'll just see what happens next. Tiffany Blackman and her daughter Victoria hauled their horse Bentley in from Seminole County, not wanting to risk the weather back home. Uh, a lot of flooding and a lot of trees have been in standing water. Kind of a little bit worrisome that the trees will come down. And of course we want the horses inside safe, you know. As I mentioned, only about 35 horses here right now. They are expecting a lot more to come in tonight because it's much easier, much cooler on the animals to haul them in at night. Reporting from the Florida State Fairgrounds, Victoria Price, 8 on your side.